Hey everyone, so after my friend's Phoebe profile, character profile, I don't know what I was going to say there, a lot of you requested that I do Joey next. So here I am doing Joey to be on his profile. Joey is a really weird character for me because I love him, but there are certain times when I don't think he is the funniest. Obviously Chandler kind of holds the title of being the funny one because he uses sarcasm a lot. But Joey is, he's not thick, but he's like, some of the things he says is a little bit like, you know, when he take on, talk on the stage name of Joseph Stalin, it was a bit like, can he honestly not know who Joseph Stalin is? And he's not, he's not as like, dim as like Phoebe sometimes comes across, because Phoebe's a bit like, kooky and quite interesting and funny in that way. Joey is just, eccentric. Obviously Joey is an actor, so I really like that aspect of him, the fact that they've got this character in a TV show who is an actor in their real world, if you know what I mean. But they have made him into a big Hollywood superstar. Obviously, Joey, his own TV series, is perhaps a little different and contradict that slightly. But he is an actor, but he's not like big and famous. He doesn't have fans coming up to him in the street every two seconds. This is Joey, not um, Matt LeBlanc, obviously. Matt LeBlanc obviously has fans. And I just think it's really, really nice. Of course, you do have that storyline where Joey had a fan who put eyelashes in an envelope and put it in the building, and she was crazy, and she didn't know the difference between Joey and Dr. Drake Ramore, and that was just like really annoying. I was also really quite excited when I found out that Days of Our Lives was a real program because I started watching Friends when I was about 12 and um, I didn't really know much about other American TV shows at the time apart from like the kids ones that were on Nickelodeon and things because I was only just starting to discover sitcoms and things and um, I was like oh Days of Our Lives sounds like an interesting show and then about two or three years ago I was like googling stuff to do with Friends and it came up that Duel was a real show and I was like oh my god how amazing is that so I also like the fact that they've incorporated Joey's career with a real TV show which for those of you who would have been familiar with the show during watching Friends would have been a nice little feel to it and um, I don't know if Joey was ever actually on Days of Our Lives the real one as like a guest appearance or whatever because I can't find out that information but if you know let me know Um, I don't really have a favorite Joey storyline I definitely prefer the latter ones to first few because not that I didn't like his style but he was just he didn't look like Joey when they used to wear jeans and his hair was all like gelled and it was just it just wasn't Joey to me Joey to me is the latter seasons and that's how I will always remember Joey one of my favorite ones is where he gets his head stuck oh, for the life of me I cannot remember the name of the episode but it's the Thanksgiving one where Chandler makes cranberry sauce and um, you know Rachel and Phoebe go to a, a pageant and Joey and Ross go to the game and they come back and the door's locked and he gets his head wedged in the door. I love that one. Obviously Joey has a lot of relationships. I'm trying to think of certain ones which I thought were memorable. Janine, I didn't really like Janine. She got on my nerves a lot. Other than that, there isn't really any which really scream at me and stick out. There was the whole Joey Rachel thing and that was never gonna work. Yes, it was nice for a while. It was nice and sweet and it was sort of like, yeah, it, it, it's nice just now. But we all know Ross and Rachel were destined to be together, so Joey intervening in that kind of made me get a little bit annoyed. I also liked the one with the jellyfish, where Joey was going on about how he was supposed to pee on um, Monica and things. So that was kind of interesting. But I don't really, like that's something, I don't remember much funny things that Joey says. It's more the things he does, or the things he doesn't say, or he doesn't the things he doesn't understand. Whereas characters like Chandler and Phoebe have funny lines and funny quotes and funny songs and Joey's just funny in general. I can't really think of anything specific that makes me laugh that he says. Obviously he loves pizza and he loves jam. <laughs> he's a really cute character. He's got loads of sisters and he's just adorable. I'm pleased we have Matt LeBlanc playing Joey. I could not imagine any other actor portraying him in such a way. And also how gorgeous does Matt look just now? Um, if you saw episodes, you've seen clips from him doing anything recently, you will know he's gone for the silver fox look. Um, and yeah, he's definitely, definitely kept up his appearance since Friends, even though it's been nearly seven years. Seven years already? I just, it, it just doesn't feel like it. I mean, I actually started watching Friends the year it finished, so that's kind of sad. And it's also hard to believe that I've only been watching Friends for seven years, and I've only been aware of Joey Tribbiani for seven years. It feels like it's been part of my life forever. But yeah, I do love Joey so, so much. He is not, like I said, the funniest character for me. But I do find him interesting. Sorry. Yawning again. 
um, yeah, so please feel free to leave your comments about Joey. Leave me, um, let me know your favourite storylines as well of Joey. Like I said, I, I really like the um, ones where he became a teacher. Um, I really like that one as well. And the one where he did the cooking class with Monica. There are so many of them. There's like 200 odd episodes that you know, I couldn't possibly mention them all. Um, but yeah, so please feel free to leave your favourite Joey quotes and stories and anything like that. And also let me know which story you want me to do next. We still have Monica, Chandler... Have I done Ross? Um, <laughs> you guys know my memory is appalling. Um, Monica and Chandler and possibly Ross if I haven't done Ross already. I'll double check but you guys will know if you've been watching them because um, you guys seem to know more about what I do than I do which is pretty appalling on my half. But yeah so please feel free to leave comments, requests etc and I'll see you all next time. Bye!